Good morning for a final time from Carnival Conquest. Last night's sleep was good. Um, but again, when you dock this whole room, it just shakes. <laughs> so they started kind of coming in at like 5 a.m. It was an early wake up call. But definitely gonna go down and get some breakfast real quick before having to be down at the theater for the excursion. So let's go check out the dining room because we are not messing with that Lido. Let's go. Okay, so we did the tour of South Beach and they gave us the option of getting off in South Beach and then coming back in like two hours to get us. We all stayed on the bus <laughs> and now we're in Little Havana. I've been here before, but it's always fun. So here they welcome you with coffee. It's actually espresso. This one has a lot of sugar in it, but it is really good. We made it back to Domino Park. Um, they sit and they play. They play with the nine domino here. Um, but this is really famous in like all the movies and stuff like that. But down here in the so the next stop is here in the cigar shop. They do have like the espresso that you can buy here also. But the main attraction the is end, the will end up cigar. Which ones you like and which... So you'll hear all about it. And they do actually roll them here in the, the store. Um, the over in the corner. So. The Pretty fun to watch. Just got done at the visitor center. It is a gift shop. They have coffee samples. They don't put sugar really in there, so it's a pretty um, like bitter coffee or espresso. But then you can just walk up and down. It's like a three block area. Um, I did it a few years ago, like a tour down here and like went really in depth. But it's a fun little place just to come hang out better than sitting at the airport. This is the Wynwood area. A lot of artists go and do graffiti and art on the buildings and it's a whole neighborhood of all this art. I'm back home. <laughs> I, that trip went so fast it seemed like I blinked my eyes and I'm back home in Kansas. Didn't have to tap the heels. But had a great weekend. Um, I was very pleasantly surprised, I will say, with it being a Labor Day cruise on a short cruise like timeline, um, also known as a booze cruise, I was expecting a lot more rowdiness, noise, that kind of thing, and I was very pleasantly surprised. It was great time. Uh, I didn't really see any like bad interactions, um, arguments. Everybody was just having a great time. There were a lot of kids, but for the most part, they were pretty well behaved. And then, um, I don't know if it's a conquest thing or a fleet wide thing, but the food has dramatically gotten better. Like I was really pleasantly surprised last night when my steak came out because it was like a good size. It was actually thick and it was done well, seasoned well. Um, I was very impressed with the food on this one which I cannot say for all of them here, like in the like recent past, because it was kind of bland and all that, but not at all this time. Very, very pleasantly surprised. Uh, they had some great activities, definitely kept you busy, all that kind of stuff. Would I go on Conquest again? Yes. Can I go right now? <laughs> um, I really did have a good time. Zach did amazing for a cruise director and a newer cruise director at that. So props to him. Um, today I got off with the excursion group. So that was really quick. Like they fast track you through. And um, I had signed up for the South Beach excursion, which is like you explore South Beach and then they drop you off for a few hours at South Beach and they come pick you back up. Well, it was Miami heat and <laughs> it was already hot and a lot of the stuff on South Beach does not open that early. So they gave us the option, especially with it being so warm and a holiday, that if we wanted to stay on the bus, um, 
we could continue on with like the top 10 of Miami. So what happened was, is like you started the tour and it was South Beach and the top 10 going together because South Beach was the beginning part. And if I was to get off, then they would have come back in a couple hours and picked me up. I just stayed on and I did the top 10 of Miami, which I had done before, but this time was a lot better. Um, we definitely saw stuff that I didn't remember seeing. Um, and the last time I went on the top 10 Miami. Um, so it was a bonus. It was plus. Um, dropped us off right at the airport. They did stop at Miami airport first and then went up to Fort Lauderdale, but I had plenty of time. So wasn't cutting it close or anything like that. So yeah, overall an amazing, amazing, amazing time. Went by way too fast. I met some amazing people. I hope they Keep in contact, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> Even if they were like trying to jump in some of the shots and whatnot, but it was fun. It was a lot of fun. Um, just everybody was kind of just friend and welcome and all that kind of stuff. You just like, kind of went group to group. It was a, it was a lot of fun. Um, people from all over too. Like usually it's a lot of like lower Southern, um, but now uh, New York, Minnesota, California, all over so it was a great diverse group but if you have any questions on conquest specifically um, I will tell you that the walls were a lot thicker than like on Liberty and Freedom where you could hear the neighbors I had a bunch of teens right next to me and I couldn't hear them at all so um, walls are thicker you don't hear as much like you did hear like I had a bachelor party um, across the hall from me in a suite so when they came in, like you could hear them in the hallway, but then once they were in their room, you couldn't hear them. So um, it is better than Freedom and Liberty that I was on, um, which were paper thin walls. But um, yeah, if you have any questions, make sure to put them down below. I'll try to answer them the best I can. But great time. When can I go back on her? And definitely made those memories and not dreams and lived every day as a gift because that's what it is. Make sure you like and subscribe because you never know when the next adventure is going to start. And we got a few in the works. So, see you later. Thanks for being here.